I'm Jessica Michelle Singleton. And I'm Steph Tolev. We're, we're slobs. Oh, man, we're so good. We really are disgusting people. This should be not allowed. Um, welcome to Slobs. We're here. We're back. We've got a really special guest this week. Jack Robichaud. We also, we have not really th- fully mentioned what we're doing here. So we had a revamp. Yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. We, by the way, welcome to the new set. I kind of just threw it on you. Yeah, you did not say anything. We have a new set. We have a new vibe. We're doing 30-minute episodes. We're having friends come on. We're making more of a party chill vibe. We invited yeah. you on. We thought you were a partier. And it turns out it's the one day in the world Jack's the fucking drinking. Yeah. yeah. Jack yeah, got yeah, sober. Yeah, yeah. He came and saw us. And he's like, well, this is my rock bottom. Yeah. As our awning Let's uh, let everyone know fell off of problem. our trailer. He's like, this is <laughs> a metaphor for... Yeah. My existence. I didn't even know we were getting started. I was like, oh, I thought that was a test run. Oh, there's my dog. Oh, she's, hi. Uh, she's an emotional support animal. She can tell because you're not drinking that you're anxious. I yeah, think the I first time I met... I'm, no, I'm met, pretty high. It's okay. okay good. The first yeah, time yeah. I met you, we... Well, we had a we had a night, but the first time I met you, yeah, yeah, met, yeah. yikes! <laughs> we fucked years ago, but the first time I met you, who didn't fuck years ago? Not us. It but. was literally one of the. I was it was like my first week here or something, and really, I was I was. Oh, you gotta get your feet wet. Wow. I was very. We were in a pool. We got, everyone left this fucking party, and me and Jack were like, I think we're doing MDMA. Were we not? Bane gave us yeah. Some, Bane, what he had left Richard Bane, yeah. Oh, Bane. oh wow, um, R.I.P. I don't know yeah. why I was like Bane, because somebody yeah. made a super villain reference the last episode. That's why. Oh right, um, yeah, yeah. Not that Bane. <laughs> um, the Bane that gives you MDMA. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Um, and yeah, we uh, we had. I mean, it was a fun night. In the pool? Went, oh, we were in the pool for a long time. We were pretty. Then we were out of the pool. Yeah. It was a fun party. It was, a, it was, yeah, it was like a whole pool party. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Pool orgy. Man. No, everyone everyone was like, I feel like I remember just near the end of it, just me and you and a couple of stragglers, and I'm like, we got to get out of here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it was, uh, it was that house. I don't know if we can, we should mention. Whose house names. was that? Yeah. Uh, Jesse Case lived there, though. Oh, Jesse. Oh, man. I haven't even heard that name in a couple of years. um, Yeah. And then, uh, yeah, it was a party. It it was (laughs) a party. Let's just say it was a party. Hollywood Uh, parties. That's what happens. There's pools. You have sex with people. Yeah, yeah, and then that's drugs. But I liked you were one of the uh, there's a few guys that I'm good friends with that we fucked and it's totally normal. Yeah, it's like one of the, it's I it's it's a it's a very nice thing to create a, a great friendship out of. It is because it's like oh, you yeah. you have this intimate thing. I consider you a thing. very close friend. Yes, so I consider yeah. you a close friend, and it's just like yeah. a very like it was no ill will after. Right. We both were just like, well, well that happened. I think yeah. we fucked again, didn't we? I don't remember to be honest. I mean, I'm not <laughs> saying no, but I don't remember. <laughs> I love that you both are kind of like. I know. I'm like, did we? I feel like, or we we were hanging out again, and we made. I don't know. It might have been a situation where it was like, you know, we're like, you know, we're, yeah, uh, we're both, like, yeah, we've we're already both done very this. single. You know? yeah, yeah, was, yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, and that's what happens. Like a me. why not? Yeah, and, yeah. Uh, you know, you already know what you're getting. Yeah, yeah. yeah it's yeah. nice when people can just be cool about it. It's it's just a sign of like yeah. general adult maturity. When man, because sometimes. Yeah, I'm blushing a little. You are. Are you? Yeah. You have, your face hasn't moved. Yeah. Well, at he all. does it. He's well, albino. I'm so pale. I was so like, pale. if you're blushing, I wanted to tell the camera person, like, if you have to turn it down, you know, <laughs> I'll blinded. blow out. I'll blow out <laughs> this <laughs> camera. <laughs> it's just white. Yeah. In a voice. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but if you were like, if you were, I, I, I've, I've ruined a friendship by fucking somebody. Mm-hmm. I had a good friend in Toronto. And we fucked, and it kind of it, it, it was never the same after. And I was pissed off. Is it because we did friends. he get weird? I found well, he did that, finger like, me when I was sleeping, and I woke up to him fingering me. So maybe that was it. Okay, that, that would yeah. sound <laughs> great. Though. That doesn't sound <laughs> no, no, it's actually like a very good bad. surprise. <laughs> yeah, that would yeah. ruin a friendship for me yeah, as well. What if you What if you woke up and the girl was your dick was in her mouth? Yeah. Well, that's just well. Nice here's the thing. Love. I think I think that's what a good it was, morning. I think what it was is that I I think from what I recall from it, I was like. That was bad. I think that was, I was very, I thought I was very, I think I talked to you about it. You thought you were like, I was was really. Was it like a really bad experience for you? Because I was just like, you know, it was wasted. I didn't even know. I I don't think, I don't remember it being bad. I think we were both. So let's talk through it. No, no, I think we were both, no, we're both drunk. I think it worked for a bit. That's my, that's my confidence level though. That's, you know, (laughs) hasn't changed much, but you know. And me, it worked for a bit. Yeah, okay, all right. It got in there for a second. All right, yeah, And then it just sort of. Yeah. Look, every guy. You're goes, drunk. It, 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 you can't be hard forever. I don't want to tell you. Yeah. <laughs> no. it, yeah. Once you hit 22, 23, yeah, sorry, it goes yeah. out the window. 
Maybe and, like yeah. the the age of fourteen that year. Maybe I would consider mm-hmm. some. That's possible. Someone could be hard for an entire year when you're like fourteen years <laughs> old. Yeah. You know? yes, but after yes, that, yes, I think yes. you're, you know you gotta. It just slowly starts waning yeah. off. Uh huh. Yep. Men never get hard. They just start getting soft. Exactly. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's a gradual. <laughs> the boner gradual goes down for a while. <laughs> yeah. 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 That's and then exactly one day it sun sets yep. and. And then they come back. But it's it's uh, it's funny because I, I love when guys. It's the one time guys get so vulnerable. Yeah, when their dicks don't get hard. Vulnerable. I can't talk. I mean, I am. I've been fucking vulnerable. They get they wait, immediately. They go. Oh, it's some guys will do the. I'm sorry, and they get like it's not usually like. I hate. Don't say oh. it's not usually like this though, because it is usually like that. Yeah, this is you, dude. Yeah, that's what I immediately if a dick gets soft, I go, that's you. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. That ain't me. I've had situations like soft and really, on me. like really drinking. You know, like there's a lot of drinking involved, and I'll like preface it sometimes. Yeah. I'll be like, this isn't gonna work. Mm-hmm. Like, yeah. I'm sorry. I already know it. Yeah. Ahead of time. I'm like, this I don't. Like, we happen. don't need to go through. Jack's the a very rigmarole. sweet man, though. I do want to say, oh, you're thanks. not a slob. You're a sweet boy because. Thanks. You kind of hooked me up with a guy, and I've told the story before. Oh, where God. I dressed like the man for Halloween and took it home and couldn't get hard anymore. Oh, but it was that was just an odd night because you came up to me, you're like, "Hey, my friend thinks you're cute," and I was fully dressed as Coach Steve. I'm like, "I think your friend's <laughs> on drugs. Like, I look like a fucking man." That's uh, so wild. And then you felt bad after because he treated me like shit, but it had nothing to do with you. Yeah, he's a scumbag, and you were like, you apologized for years after. I'm like, this isn't on you. Yeah. Well, how would you know how he like? There was a, there was a middle situation where I, I kind of had to do a little middleman thing, right? I, I I basically told him I was like, I think what needs to happen is maybe you apologize. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah, I know he needs you know, to apologize. Yeah, like, I'm kind of doing it, and that's not. It's not your. <laughs> yeah, that's yeah. I shouldn't be going. Like, yeah, sorry, yeah. he's like that. Yeah, that's yeah. Well, you don't know. Like, you don't know that your friends are gonna be. And he wasn't like in your close tight group of friends. He was like a more right. outskirt guy. It wasn't like Ryan or like yeah. fucking Greg, and um, they like you would have known how they are. Yeah, and he's from the same part of town, like from same part of the country, you know, mm-hmm. like the same area um, where I grew up. So it's where are you from? That. I'm from New Hampshire. New Hampshire. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I thought maybe you, I knew you, where are you, you were surprised? from. Surprised? Yeah, I just would surprise anyone's from New Hampshire. Uh, what happens yeah. there? What's the gross thing that's happened there? What's your big claim to fame, New Hampshire? <sighs> Oh, big claim to fame in Like, what's like a thing Yeah, what do you guys do? Really not, I don't, I don't know. (laughs) I was like, I don't know anything about the place. Where is it? I have the least idea about that state out of all of them. It's in them. Right below, uh, uh, it's below Montreal. Oh. Yeah, so it's on that, it's on the East Coast. Yeah, some people call it New Hampshire. No, that's yes. French. No, New Hampshire. <laughs> yes. Yeah, yeah, let's, hear, let's hear this history lesson. Yeah, BMVU Hampshire. Uh, yeah. I am from the original Hampshire. Uh huh. Yeah. Nothing Amp-shire? at all. Hampshire? I Nothing's think it's. Happened. No, I mean, as far as I know, there's a. It's just, there's woods. Um, <laughs> okay. Uh, very, my town had very little uh, people of color. It was all. Mostly mm-hmm, white. Mm-hmm. You're actually the tannest person from yeah, 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 yeah. You know, yeah, I did pretty, That's... pretty good there. I was considered uh, exotic. You know, yeah, exotic. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. Like, ooh, what is he? Yeah, he's almost <laughs> so pale that he's the darkest person. Yeah, you're yeah. almost so pale you can see the organs. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Thanks, guys. Great. I'm gonna go to a tanning bed after this. <laughs> hey, look, I still fucked you, so I don't want to tell you. Hey, I, you know, turns out pale doesn't. It. Uh... <laughs> pale, it's fine. <laughs> Yeah. Tanning, I've never... But I also did fuck your friend there. Actually, technically, I didn't fuck that guy because he couldn't get hard. And uh, guess what? That yeah. was apparently my fault. So it never happened. He said never. it was your fault? That, he's, he looks... Well, because you took off the mustache? He's, well, that's what I... That's I have. I literally have a joke about this. Didn't you kind of recently, too? Uh, like, I don't, I'm not taking... Uh, uh, I didn't hook this up, but didn't... Uh, there was another guy. I think I was around, at least. Oh, there was someone else who hooked up. up. I was like... You didn't learn your lesson. Kind of recently, where I was like, "Oh, you guys are," and then you you made it happen with that guy too. Who was that? Are we not naming his name? Yeah, I'm, I'm bad at naming names. I don't like doing it. Is it the? Is it a comic? Yeah. Ooh, we'll bleep it, out. bleep it out. You stopped because of a reason that he was. You know, there was. A... Oh, someone who might have secretly had a girlfriend. No, the other thing. Secretly been the a pedophile. Of Secretly, not this? been into ladies. He was. He would. He was fucking dudes. 
Oh, that uh, guy. Yeah. Yeah, 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 oh, yeah. old fucking dude. No, no, oh, yeah. Greg's friend. Prop no, 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 no. Yeah, that yeah, was yeah, yeah. no. I had no problem with that. I mean, he. I didn't mind that he was bi. He was just. He would really like to tell me about the guy's dicks he's sucking. I was like, okay. Yeah. I'm like, this doesn't turn me on. Yeah. I'm yeah, like, yeah. I don't care what you do. You can fuck who you want, but like, I don't need to hear about it. You're like, this is probably really hot for another guy. Well, that was a while he's ago. Trying some girl talk. That was years ago. You know how it is. Was it that years was ago? so long. That was. Really I don't know how COVID. time works anymore. I'm like, yeah, I was like, how have I not heard? How did I hear? about this yeah that's why i thought he meant old I man recently. i don't even know how old i am wait he, just, he hooked you up with an old man no as well? I, my, the old man i was fucking that I'm, I'm definitely not saying his goddamn name in the podcast oh that, that old man that i thought you meant the man who lived in the oh, air stream old man how can old we, is old man get an age yeah how old is 60 near 60 yeah wow no wait no. or is he 50s early 50s he's late 50s are we that's talking not good shape 60s or? Mm, pretty good for 60 he thinks he is okay better than a lot like picture man in his 60s Probably doesn't look like that. No, no, he's not like just as blind for sure. Yeah, <laughs> maybe worse. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, no. But he's no, no. Wow. But that was so long ago. Okay. But he right. still was. He still rocking a boner. He was. You know why? Because he's sober. That makes a difference. I honestly think. I think people who've been sober their whole lives. I think. I yeah. think the cocks work differently. Yeah. Mm. It's I'm all... making this up though. I don't know. I didn't think. I, oh wait, the older guy. Yeah, older guys okay, never drank, yeah, yeah. so I feel old like, sober. I feel like maybe, yeah, old sober. I mean, sober. yeah, you're, you, I, I hear it all the time that drinking is poison, and it's, it's like, yeah, I know that. Yeah, you but. You do it anyway. I mean, well, why? I'm not. never going to stop doing it. Yeah, no I'm way. trying to poison myself. Yeah. No, it's insane. You, There's no fucking way. That's wild. I don't know the oldest guy I've ever been with. Uh, not Maybe a 50. I, I mean. I don't think I've gone above. Oh, a man. Hey, yeah. he, I was like, what did this be about? Five. Okay. Ugh. Never? never? How old are you? You're uh, 35, right? 37. Oh, shit. You've never yeah. fucked, a, fucked a woman your age. <laughs> no, I mostly have. Hey, what oh. is it? I haven't gone above oh. that. Oh, okay. Or, or like when you were younger, maybe you fucked a 35-year-old. Yeah. I haven't done too... No, I had... The oldie was the one that was it. And that oh, was, yeah, I was an outlier. I didn't go on like... A, I wasn't like, now I'm hitting the nursing home. <laughs> Shady Oaks isn't going to know what's... Actually, no. Who, who am I kidding? I, I fucked a guy even older than Oldie. Didn't before. he live in one of these? He did. Actually, he lives in a trailer right by your house. <laughs> the one that's out in front of the Chinese restaurant? It's... No, cool. not the one that's like on my street that has the Joker in the back window. No, but there is one like two streets over from you, and it was that one. It was a. It was a, he Who lives in an air Are you street. guys fucking with? How are you? Guys, I'm how not. Are you, how are you guys getting out to the trailer park stuff? And <laughs> no, it's a motorhome. First of all, and... I think she was leaving the. What, what is that bar called? That dive bar, the drawing room. Oh yeah, no. And no, you're no, like, ah, no. oh, it's too far to go home. I'll just wander <laughs> into this motorhome <laughs> that parks on Hillhurst yes. or whatever. Okay. Yeah, that's, that's, no, I, I, it's called. Gotta go to the bathroom. It's called. I was very. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's called I was very sad and depressed and then fucking anybody. I didn't care. Yeah. Here's yeah, what I want to know. Mean. Where did you meet that guy? That guy was on a dating app. On an app. Mm -hmm. And he looked, I, because I, I put it pretty old. I was, the younger guys were not matching with me. So I went, fuck it. So I went to like 60. I went up 60 and he was older. Jesus. But he was like all tattoos. We like looked kind of, he looked younger in his photos. And like kind of like hot, grungy older guy. Yeah. And then he's been bands and stuff. And then he like, yeah, he bluntly was like, I'm not feeling it with you. And I was like, fiddly D. <laughs> He said Thanks that? for the honesty. Yeah, and I was like, yes. you're, I'm not feeling with you either because your cock doesn't work. So yeah. technically, we're both not feeling Yeah, you live in a Winnebago. No one's yeah. feeling anything in here. <laughs> yeah. This is a heroin den. It's a risk. It's a, it's a, it's a fucking circus out there. It is. But yeah. so you. I went, I went three years out here. Of without, nothing? Without getting laid. Three were you on the ass? Three years. Really? When I first moved out here. Um, I was really, I, I'm not using this as an excuse, but I was really focused on comedy. I was like really getting, getting well, yeah, me more too, yeah. but like, and everything, but I just like, it's only Mike so late and then I, no, that's the thing, but I was so, it was like a weird mental thing where it was just like, it like it, you know, I got, it wasn't that big of a deal and uh -huh. like, but I was just like, I was drinking a lot and I was just really like, kind of like hang with the boys well, yeah, and you had your sketch and, you stuff know. going to and stand up. You're doing a lot of stuff. Yeah. Yeah. yeah so, you know, I was like, but it, that's not an excuse. I was, I was, I would have liked to, you know, for something to happen. But I think if, I was so out of it for so long <laughs> that it was like, it really, you, you kind of forget yeah. how to like be a, make it happen. Yeah. 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 Oh, damn. It's different for guys. Yeah. Three you got to like. Put in moves. You gotta put in moves. Yeah. That's. We'll take a quick break here. Is that the break? That's yeah. a break. But guess what? We're back. Okay, three years you were no sex. Three years of drought. But now you've been in a relationship for a few years now. Uh, it'll be three years coming up. Oh shit! Wow, uh, what a turnaround. Yeah. She's also a very funny comedian. Yep. She. Yeah. I yeah. don't know anything. I live yeah, in a hole. You know, I didn't even know you had a girlfriend. Yeah. yeah, I mean, I'm not. I don't. You know, I don't sing it from the tops of the. 
from rooftop. Yeah, well, yeah, and it's not like I was like, <laughs> "Hey, Jack." Yeah, <laughs> but I just yeah. you just don't know. You miss. You, no, here's what true. it is: is that the algorithm doesn't put everyone's photos in my. I don't know. If you can put photos. <laughs> it's also I just see the same three. Yeah, people. there's no need. I, I yeah, only let's blame yeah. the algorithm. Let's we don't hang out enough. Is what it is. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. I mean, I like. You talked about the group, you know. I yeah. we, we hang out every once in a while, but like, there's a, I really hang out with like four people, yeah, you know? mm-hmm. Like, mm-hmm. consecutively. It's yeah. Uh, I feel like know. that's comedy's a lot of little groups with overlaps. Right, right. Like it's very nice. Tiny yeah. thing. It's that... very nice spreading it out every once in a while, but yeah, it's too overwhelming to yeah. do it all the time. You have your inner circle. I like. Yeah, I like. I pop into your inner circle every now and then for like a party or something. Yeah. And I'm like, it's fun, and I. You know, I tried to fuck Ryan for five years, and that never worked. But uh, <laughs> he's a tough one to grab. I mean, if I, if I tried, I mean, I would just awkwardly flirt with him, and it wasn't flirting at all. And then he would like laugh awkwardly, and I'd go, "Well, I've made a huge mistake." And then I'd walk away, and that'd be it. Um, yeah. I did that for a very. And then we had him on our podcast, and I was like, "Sorry." Well, <laughs> they're all very big fans of of you and you guys. Too. Yeah, no, they're <laughs> they're they're fun people, and um, oh, yeah, they're great. You gotta I mean, surround yourself with good people. Out I'm yeah. feeling like I feel like I have no friends all of a sudden. Do you ever get that? No. Yeah, well, that's literally. So we're all on a kickball team. Well, Steph's not on this season, but like, that's how I felt. <laughs> that busy, I was like, "Damn it, I'm not here." Yeah. Well, here's what I realized is like before comedy, I used to be extremely social, and then I was like to a ten like comedy like hyper focused when I moved out here. So I'd meet people and be like, "Hey," and get in these little conversations. But there's just like a handful of people. Like you, you talk to someone, you're like, "Oh, I feel like I could be really good friends with them." But I would, I never made any effort yeah. to hang out with anybody because I'm like, I gotta, gotta grind. <laughs> and then I was like, I want to just be around people and i need to force myself to have like like a thing to go to well, that's yeah. what that's i think that we started the kickball thing to be like let's do this let's and... just fucking hang with people like who do we like yeah uh-huh. another <laughs> extracurricular activity that isn't comedy yeah, yeah because even but we can still be around each other and be comedians yes yeah. do something else and make other fun of the other teams yeah yeah well because i i also don't know about you guys but like being friends with comedians like my instinct when hanging out and maybe this is just workaholism but i'm always like oh it has to be to do something is that just me? Mm. I'm a sick one. Yeah, that's alcoholic. psychotic. Yeah, you have a healthy social life. You're like on a bike, and I'm like, what if we made a show about bikes? Like as opposed to just <laughs> chilling out and like not doing anything? Like yeah, I think it's, we'll it's just... more like I won't reach out unless I have like a creative idea to work on. Oh, something. got it. Like, yeah, yeah. I'm I mean, I'm a, little, I'm a little weird about it. Like if someone's like, we should do lunch or coffee, and if I don't hang out with them a lot... It is kind of like, a, I'm like, all right, I got to, all right, I got to be a person. And I tried to do that with a few people in the last like year out of like, we'd get along. Let me just like be weird and be like, yeah. let's grab a coffee and then we'll hang out and it won't be weird. And then I was like, man, this is weird. Yeah. They are waiting for me to want something from them. And I don't. I just thought we should hang out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I've established though, it's like usually both people are thinking that. And then yeah. it's just, you just got to be like, yeah, hey, it's cool. They're probably like a little... Uh, yeah. Weird about being social too. They're fucking comedians. No, we're comedians. You know, we're we're like, I want everyone to love me. Don't look at me. Yeah. Well, I, that's why I'm like, I, I want to find friends that are not at all comedians. And I have like two in the city. In this city, I have Nate. <laughs> Literally. And then now, and yeah. Well, also, I mean, you're, you, you know, you, uh, it's, it's hard. You can't, you're coming from Canada, and the people that are out here from Canada that you might have been friends with before here are all comedians. Are all comedians. Yeah, yeah, no yeah, yeah, is, yeah. No yeah. one else is going to, like, you're, if you had any friends there, they're not going to move out. And they're all going a bit crazy. I, I'm realizing that I'm having some friends that are going a little bit kooky. L.A. does something to people. Yeah, yeah. ruins LA, them. L.A. does something to, to- And dogs. And dogs. <laughs> L.A. does something to, to people out here, and, and I think it, it takes a few years, and all of a sudden, a switch goes off. And you become a, a different version of who you were. Like uh, the, these people I became friends with are now like I don't want to use the term crazy thirsty, but it, it's it's a it's oh a, no people hit a wall of like panic where if they haven't yes. achieved a certain amount. Yes. I've seen it with a lot of people where you go oh like you see a shift where they're like it's like a desperation. Yes, and you go no no just, no don't just don't relax. do this because like, like, like it's gonna yes. be okay. It's you're gonna get to wherever you're yes. going like fucking. You don't need to like pretend to strike up a conversation with that person because you think that they can have, like. Mm-hmm. Right. Yeah. What do you? Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's hard to watch. When it's hard like- to watch, and I don't know what to say to these people because I know I'm gonna offend them. Yeah. Well, because it's just like, relax. Yeah. Yeah. I think you yeah. gotta really just hold on to like who you are. Yeah. The good parts of who you are, and be like, all right, just don't. If you hold on to that as as hard as you can. Yeah, and like, don't try to be like, what are they? What do they okay. want me to be? Yeah, the industry. Like, yeah, exactly. Like your principles and everything. That'll that'll like cross over into 
comedy and your yeah. career. Be yeah. Like true with it, you know? Yeah. Cause other people are like you. So that you're going to be relatable. It's just like people get this. And I think it's a thing, especially when you're out here, it probably happens in New York, but like every, like not, I'm going to say everyone pops at different times because some people don't ever pop. And I think that's what everyone's like fear is, but you'll see your friends like start to like rise in their level. And mm-hmm. I think some people, can't break that comparison thing mm-hmm. of like right yeah oh yeah, fuck like yeah. they're doing that's it i guess it's i'm being left behind and your friend's like yeah no i just booked a thing like yeah i think it also is less in new york only because there's so much more stage time yeah so i think all my friends in new york are constantly bopping around they have this that and the other show in one night and so they're constantly oh, yeah. doing stuff but out here it's like you, you know you think. go for you have a thing you go for weeks or whatever not having good shows and seeing like you know, so I'm, I'm posting every night. I'm doing this and this. And yeah, I feel like yeah, and, and like you'll I, have then runs. I feel bad because I'm like I don't want my friends feeling like I. I you don't, don't need to feel bad because you're booked, booked I, and busy. I, I feel like I, I, <laughs> I don't know. To be well, and that's how it goes. Like in in the city you live in, too. Like here, it's like if you were visiting LA, you'd probably get more spots. But it's like I don't know about you. It, like it comes in chunks sometimes where you're like, oh, there's so many shows, and then you have so many in a row that you're not even thinking about the future. And then all of a sudden, a week comes where you're like, I've got nothing. Yeah. yeah. And instead yeah, of just yeah. going, okay, well, I'll write or I'll go like. Hang out with friends. It's like I'm failing one night without yeah, shows. Yeah, and you're I'm like, like this is what if I've yeah. wasted? They were just. Yeah. I, I was overhearing the last one, and you guys were like, "Ah, what's where's everyone at?" This is, I, I have nothing, nothing tentatively. <laughs> <laughs> I did a show like this week, but like after that, like not. That's what happens. You're just like, it okay, so I just don't do comedy anymore. Well, that's and then, how like it feels. A, wait, a, wait a wait a few days, and then yeah, yeah, yeah. Happen, or just like reach out. You know? Yeah, the, the lack of people reaching out because like. Do you want? I do. I I I'd ask you to vote for me. But I feel weird asking people I find really funny to vote for me. Like, oh, why do you fucking would, would coward? Of a hat. Would, Follow yeah. him. I would love it. Fine. Oh, because you think it like offends them? Like, uh, yeah, I think it offends them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I'm, I think I'm you should know that, it. like, anyone mm-hmm. who is your like friend and seeing what you are, what's happening for you is like you're just you're finally having like your moment where people are seeing you and you're getting these things. Anyone who's your friend that you want to open for you is going to be like, hell yeah, cool, yeah. thank you. Mm-hmm. Because if that's truly, how it goes. Yeah, if they're truly your friend and they truly think you're funny, which you are, it's like, yeah, it's, it's a, you know. Also, imagine the psychopath who's not, who has, like, isn't getting any, <laughs> like, industry success. And you're like, hey, you want to open for me? And they're like, Pfft for you yeah and they like don't have any shows booked and like they have nothing going on and like yeah yeah, i don't need you yeah that's all just ego pride that's a you know that exists there are people like that yeah oh people burn their own shit down with an ego oh yeah 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 yeah, being like i'm too good for that so i'll go do my i also just realized i never got back to you i do want to do that script i read it it's very funny oh nice you you send a very (laughs) well i was like like, that's the thing i i escape to like i I love stand up you know and i've never been on tv for it or anything but like i'm never gonna stop as far as i Mm. know but it's like i i can always escape to like writing scripts and stuff and it's like that's like a at least another thing that you can do that you're not you know comparing yourself to yeah yeah it's like yeah, it's also like such a process sometimes that it's like it's nice to have things where you can just enjoy the process for yeah. a while instead of like, oh, I, this is for X, Y, Z or just right. like creating something. Because yeah. I think in L.A. or just anywhere like with social media, too. I haven't felt that in years. I, I honestly feel like everything is constantly like got to get this out. Got to fuck it. Like, I'm like, yeah, no, it's, it's like I got to do this stressful. because yeah. of this. Like I haven't written a sketch just to like what you did just to be like, yeah. well, this would be fun to do. Maybe someone do. I have not. I, it's like get this clip out, pump this out. Fucking yeah. who well, cares? You're, you're, you're also. Yeah. yeah, you're also like uh, like more specifically a performer you know like yeah 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 yeah. yeah. you know like i enjoy being alone and sitting and writing and like just like closing myself off Mm -hmm. you know and then i'll go out and do a show and it's like yeah yeah, 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 yeah. you know what i mean but you're like a you're that's that's where it is you that's uh, where it is and that's what i gotta do yeah get me up there but it's also enjoy the like new jokes you're doing you know that's like a been a big goal Mm -hmm. for me too is to like when I'm doing something new or working on something creative, not put that pressure of like, this is going to be the big thing or whatever. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. No, just like we all, I assume, got into this because we like making people laugh. Yeah. And like, I don't know about you guys, but I was like the silly friend and you just like do something and then you're laughing, your friends are laughing, everyone's pissing their pants and it's like, I want to stay in that feeling. Of like, I just yeah. think it's silly I'm going to do it instead of like, I gotta. what time do I put this up and it's got to yeah, hit no. the crowd and are they going to get it? And it's like, yeah, I do that all the time, but I'm trying to do more of, yeah. Like, yeah. this is silly and dumb and I'm going to do it because I think it's funny. What yeah. if there was a comedian that, 
like hated la- like laughter. Like they'd make a joke. Enough. Like, oh, shit. <laughs> I hate that. Oh, <laughs> again, again. Uh, it's very uh, piercing. Keep your eye on the it's prize. It's too get, loud. Get this money. Get yeah. this money. Just get stay in check. it. I do get it for the, the money. Out of here. Honestly, it's like nails on a chalkboard. Yeah. People are laughing. <laughs> yeah, like I most people it. at a day job at a nine to five, yeah. they're like, ugh, another day at the office. People are chanting. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, ugh. Oh, I hate it. God. It makes me sick. I... <laughs> there probably is someone out there who got like jaded. by the end of it, got jaded. Yeah. I will say on stage, I do like it. My favorite thing is when someone goes, Jesus Christ. Oh, like, that gets, I get so like, grossed from, out. Like from, yeah. like from yeah. the audience. Oh, yeah. The, oh, yeah then yeah, a laugh. Yeah. A Jesus Christ a is Jesus, my favorite oh, yeah. reaction. I get a I lot of Jesus. what's. I get a lot of what? <laughs> and then a little laughter. But it's, like, <laughs> it's like, yeah, I get it. It doesn't make a lot of sense. Yeah, I yeah. It, what's uh, very funny. Yeah. Yeah. That's, that's so funny. Yeah. I get, I have a specific joke that gets a lot of Jesus. Yeah. To the point that I'm like, oh, like I'm, I'm almost like, oh, I guess I guess no one's that shocked with. In this crowd <laughs> like yeah yeah oh uh, it's the best but the more i like the more i do comedy the more i think that that's the kind that i like the kind that gets those reactions yeah like, yeah if people yeah. are just laughing that's one thing but if people are like kind of appalled every once in a while yes it's getting a little more interesting to, to I, I want to appall a little bit. I yeah. like I like and I, the oh like those reactions like people getting viscerally upset. Yeah, that's, yeah. my God. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, it's that's great. A good time. Yeah. That's I mean you gotta mix it up. <laughs> Definitely you know? had that last time. You can't night. just can't just crush with laughs. No, <laughs> no, you need a fucking whip, wispy woo. Yeah. yeah, a fucking a wispy woo. A wispy woo. Man, we got we got comedy heavy here. We need comedy oh, heavy yeah. here. Very okay. comedy heavy. Relation see. relationships and then comedy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, old. But yeah, so you you're living with your GF now. Yep. Just fucking every minute of the day. I huh? just waking up. I could oh, probably I could probably uh, <laughs> contribute a little bit more on that. I feel like you know it's uh, you know. Yeah. I like to I like to make it a treat. I guess you know what I mean. It's like it, it's more meaningful if you give it a give it a. Give it a day or so. Oh, you, you mean know? you can't get back to it immediately, so you have to I pretend could, that they're I kinda, I'm like, you know, it's like I don't want to, you know, I don't want to tire myself out from it. You know, it's like it's nice wow. to, it's nice to give it is, some. That is know. why women become cougars. <laughs> <laughs> it's like I need a man to fuck me. Like he thinks the amount he does it in a row is some measure of his man. <laughs> I yes. fuck. I I I am definitely more horny than Zach. Oh, I'm yeah. far more horny than Nate, and it's. I've heard, I've heard from like female friends that that's the case. It just happens. Like, Our yeah, body's yeah. going to overdrive. Yeah. We're just like, oh yeah, mm-hmm. I need more. Yep. That yeah. I frankly, oh. she's one hundred percent more horny than I am. Yeah. Yeah. And you're like, let's just take our time. Yeah. No. It's it's also because Zach doesn't live here, so when he's here, I'm like. Get the cock out. And get it too. In. Yeah, yeah. Fill. Get it out. Uh, get it in. Fill it up. Fill the hole. Fill the void. He's getting off the airplane. Take it out. Yeah. Oh no. I'm pull out the weenie. Oh, I tried to suck his dick on, on, on the drive. I was like, he's like, what are you doing? Oh, like, you were driving. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> no, you take like, the wheel. Tell me if I need the brake. My break. thing is crazy. My thing is that uh, um, I am so uninterested in anything involving my asshole. Oh. What? Like if, like yeah. <laughs> wait, my, wait, when did assholes come into it? No, my, okay, no, my, uh, just you as know, a general concept. My my uh, partner is. Uh, she's, she's like play with she's my asshole. Like, she's meant. She's like, can I get in there? And I'm like, no, I don't. It's <laughs> she's hungry. You don't want to go down there. She's but she like, does. No, I don't let her. No. Finger. No, it's no, a haunted forest not. back Nothing. there. Oh, I'm wants... like, I shit out of there. It's not <laughs> pretty. It's not a great Don't even place. Bidet? She looks in there and she sees the headless horseman. No. Okay. Yeah, if I yeah, if I yeah. prepared, even if I prepared, just like the you're never you fully know, prepared. It's and I don't think I don't think there's anything sort of like it's not like a homophobic thing. It's more of just like a it's like an area that like it's it's closed off. Like it's like yeah. a it's under like, it like clenches. Permit. Like the second she goes back there, you're like eh. yeah. I don't. It's, I get it because I I my thing is like it's a lingering fear of like. But what if there is a little poop? That's somewhere. In, and in my case, like pr- probably. <laughs> I really think probably it's yeah, gonna be. Like I've that. seen my underwear. There yeah. are things left behind. Yeah, yeah. The only time anyone should ever be back there, I've said this before, is straight out of the shower. Immediately out of you the need, shower. Or, or in the shower. Out of the shower. Well, I, I'd like to clean it myself, to in be honest. If I could clean yeah. Zach's asshole, I'd get right in there. Oh, if you just like did the like soap it up. 
Oh, so oh, so Ben. I I'd, yeah. I'd be f- I'd be fingering so Ben. Yeah, no, there. up like oh, up yeah. into the asshole. Oh, into the asshole. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He fills up like that. Like he's just like filling with soap, and he floats away. <laughs> <laughs> no, he needs to fill up. He needs to clean that ass. He's got a very hairy asshole too, and he wants me to go back there. Oh, he he's he's like into it. He's oh, he loves it. Oh, yeah. No, once I don't you, know. Once you, it's a I've once heard, you yeah. do it. You yeah. can't go back. Yeah, that's, that's the it. problem. Is if you do maybe it for a guy, he's thing. gonna want maybe it. Maybe I just gotta try it, and then I'll, maybe I'll never go back. That's but. the thing. Then you'll be yeah. begging for it. Because I've heard gonna... every time I bring it up to people that are into it, they're like, oh, they're like, wait, you don't, well, you don't want? You I might got like, some no, up there right now. Yeah, I was gonna say, then you turn to that guy that's always walking on the butt plug in every time I see you. <laughs> yeah. well, he's just got a little white claw back there yeah, like, yeah. for later after the after the assless chaps. Doing poppers, doing poppers every fucking hour. Lube up, yeah, Feels good. Feels good. I feel alive. Well, on that note, on that note, we got to wrap this up. That's the end of that's very quick episodes. It's almost too fast. And maybe it is. We'll adjust eventually. We'll adjust. Give us your feedback. Are you like I like them in and out? What are you thinking? But we're having fun. Too much. Yeah. Um, was that a half hour? It was. Yeah, it was. All right. Where can the people find you? Um, just at Jack Robichaud. Um, J A C K R O B I C H A U D. Go watch. Go that. watch his, his old sketch videos too. You gotta. Yeah, like I said, I don't have any dates right now, <laughs> but you know, fingers crossed, the next couple of days I'll figure something out. But yeah, check out my videos. That's Book a good Jack. Thing. Yes. Yeah. Hire me as a writer or something. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yes. <laughs> or something. Yeah. yeah. Um, and then I don't even know when this is coming out. We're come see us. Come to Houston Riot Comedy Festival at the end of yes. March, March twenty third to twenty sixth. Um, if this is before February 10th and 11th, I'm in Escondido at Grand Comedy Club. Oh, and yeah, that's all. That's where it'll be. February 25th, uh, 23rd, no, February 23rd in Vancouver. We added a show. We got one more show. Uh, and then South by Southwest. I'm doing South by March 10th to 12th. I'm pumped up for that. That's going to be sick. Uh, I'll be in Birmingham, Alabama the weekend after that, 17th. 18th fucking St. Patrick's Day in Birmingham. Yikes. Wow. Good um, Lord. You're going to die of alcohol. And then we're in uh, Houston, and then that's that. That's that. Let's party. Uh, I got other date somewhere. Go to my Instagram. Yeah, and follow at Slobspot on Instagram. Uh, go subscribe to our YouTube. We have the whole episode on YouTube. See our cool set. Yes, see us. See uh, our dogs. Yeah, see the dogs. They're always here now, and uh, or they they're are cute. for a while. And uh, They're cute. Patreon.com slash Slobs or Slobspot. I don't know. Subscribe. Okay, bye. Bye. Follow the podcast at Slob's Pod. Follow me at Steph Tolev. Follow me everywhere on the internet at JMS Comics.